Finding a quiet place to make this short video, walking to this relatively remote place reminded me how special and relevant nature is, how wonderful and happy it makes me feel, and how lucky I was as a child to have parents that loved nature and passed that on to me. I'm only disappointed that I could not be with you in the Peak District, sharing that wonderful landscape and the equally wonderful Bilberry Bumblebee, which I hope you managed to see in the flesh today. Bumblebees are widely beloved and inspirational, and they're even sacred in some cultures. Furthermore, there's been growing awareness that bees, and nature generally, can contribute to a sense of well-being beyond material gain. Bumblebee Conservation Trust has continued to build on this theme as it drives action, as can be demonstrated through our successful project work. Admiration and respect for bumblebees continues to motivate action through my colleagues on the Board of Trustees, staff, volunteers and the public at large. Through our project, Pollinating the Peak, we have an opportunity for others of all ages across society to experience that feeling of happiness in our beautiful countryside, brought to them by the charismatic and enchanting vehicle, the Bilberry Bumblebee. More importantly, through this project, we can make bumblebee conservation and the Heritage Lottery Fund contribution to this project visible to all. We'll be able to see our work jointly recognised, and that is important for lottery players and all those involved in the project and beyond. I've arrived at the Trust through a corporate career route and instinctively know that creativity at work is important. If creativity sees the light of day, if it actually happens, that's innovation. And innovation means growth. At Bumblebee Conservation Trust, our future depends on our ability to be creative at work. To be different, to be inspirational, audacious even, and engaging. Pollinating the Peak is that project that unique bringing together of boldness and creativity to produce something so innovative and exciting, people want to be part of it. Having more children interested in pursuing scientific paths benefits all of us. Scientific and technical endeavours have been crucial to this nation's success. And by leading the way in bumblebee science, Bumblebee Conservation Trust is spearheading a reversal in some of the trends we are seeing of children opting not to study science. We hope in our mobile poly lab will play an important role in reversing this trend. The Pollinating the Peak project, above all others, is a once in a lifetime opportunity to build on the momentum the development phase has so expertly built. People are excited, engaged, and the team up here in the Peak District are the catalyst to achieving this. They have been exceptional in bringing to life an idea that started at a conference in London in 2014. I'm very grateful to them all. They've done a fantastic job for this project. It was one I was very keen to see flourish. Pollinating the Peak is not the only project in the Trust's current plans. Over the past two years, we have become expert in developing, delivering, seeking and successfully funding projects from the north of Scotland to Devon, from Wales to Kent. We have recently been awarded a grant from the Heritage Lottery for our ambitious Making a Buzz for the Coast project in Kent. We cannot wait to get started. It's the realisation of an enormous amount of work by our Conservation Manager Sam, our Strategy and Engagement Manager Dawn and our Finance Manager Sandra. A remote team who cracked working together despite distance, different working hours, different days and different skill sets. If it demonstrated nothing else to me, it was the commitment and dedication of a team of people who decided they would make things work, in spite of. Underpinning this was the support of our trustees whose advice, guidance and incredibly challenging questions kept us on the course to success. The future is looking bright for the Trust. We have a full complement of trustees with a skill set covering all areas from fundraising and marketing to finance and, of course, our core work, science and conservation. We have dedicated and committed staff with an embedded loyalty to the Trust, which is very rare to find. Our sustainability and resilience is steadily increasing. 
With continued success and profile, we can build the trust into a charity that stands apart, high in integrity, reputation, staff satisfaction, but most important of all, a charity that does what it says on the tin. It saves the sound of summer. Thank you.